We now move on to look at a different kind of pattern. Have a look at this pattern, 3, 6, 12, 24. What do you predict the next term will be? Hopefully you're noticing very easily that what we're doing each time is just doubling, multiplying by 2. So to get to the next term, we'll multiply by 2 and we'll get 48. And the next term after that, again, we'll just multiply by 2 and we will get 96. Now, we don't want to just carry on multiplying by 2 each time. We'd like to, for example, be able to easily answer what's term number 100 or what's term number 532. And to do that, we need to develop a formula for Tn. How are we going to do that? I'm going to use a table just to help me sort this all out. So I've written my pattern, of, well, at least the first four terms of it, into this table. And now I'm going to almost try and undo, you know, I'm going to try and see what calculation did I do to get to the 6? What calculation did I do to get to the 12? So the 3 was just what we started with. What did I do to get to the 6? Well, I started with a 3 and multiplied by 2. So that's the calculation I did. What did I do to get to the 12? Well, I started with a 3, multiplied by 2, multiplied by 2. So I did 3, multiply by 2, multiply by 2. And what did I do to get to the 24? Started with a 3, multiplied by 2, multiplied by 2, multiplied by 2. So 3, multiply by 2, multiply by 2, multiply by 2. Now what you're going to see is if I write this using exponential notation, I'll be able to spot the formula sitting there. This was just 3. This is this just 3 times 2 to the power of 1. Here we've got 3 times 2 times 2. That's 2 to the power of 2. And here we've got 3 and then we've got 2 times 2 times 2. 3 2's multiplied together. So that's 2 to the 3. Now take a look here what we can see. For term number 2, we just have 1 2. For term number 3, we have two twos multiplied by it together. For term number 4, we have three twos multiplied together. So what do you predict we're going to have for term 10? Hopefully you said it's going to be nine twos multiplied together. And if I asked you what would happen maybe for term number... 205, hopefully you'd say, noticing the pattern, that it's going to be 2 to the power of 204. And that gives us the idea of what we're going to do for Tn. It's just going to be 3 multiplied by not just n, it's going to be just the number that was one smaller than n.